In this video, I am going to tell you the action of insulin on muscle. Hey everyone, welcome back to HM Learnings. I am Harshita, the creator of HM Learnings, where students come to clear their concept and to get the study material. Make sure that you have subscribed my channel. You can also follow HM Learnings on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter for daily updates. We have started uploading all our content on website called SlideShare. So you can easily download and clip our slides from that website. So today we are going to talk about that how the insulin is going to act on the muscle and how it is going to influence the metabolism of the muscle. So insulin is the hormone which is secreted by the pancreas and we have already seen the mechanism of release of the insulin, the action of the insulin on the liver cell as well as its action on the adipose tissue. So now in this video we are going to talk about that how it is going to act on the muscle. So insulin is present in the blood and now it will act via the insulin receptor on the muscle cell. So after binding to the insulin receptor, this is the insulin is going to trigger about four main actions inside the muscle. So very first action is that it is going to cause the translocation of the GLUT4 on the membrane. So GLUT4 is basically present inside the vesicles in the muscle cells. So the vesicles under the influence of the insulin, they start moving towards the membrane and then they will be incorporated on its membrane. So because of this GLUT4, what happens? The facilitated diffusion of the glucose can take place. So the glucose which is present in the blood can now enter inside the muscle cell. So that is how the uptake of the glucose is increased by the action of the insulin on the muscle cell. Now we are going to see the second thing. So second thing is that it is going to increase the process of glycolysis. So all the key enzymes of the glycolysis which are the rate limiting steps of the glycolysis, their expression, their uh, transcription will be get increased. So insulin is going to act at the gene level. It is going to increase the transcription of the uh, hexokinase, phosphofructokinase and the pyruvate kinase. Also it is going to increase the glycogen synthesis okay so by that what happens that the glucose one phosphate will be converted more into the glucose glycogen so uh, uh, it is important because muscle is what muscle is skeletal muscle activity is required during the exercise so glycogen act as a source of the energy for the muscle so that is why the high amount of the glycogen is needed so glycogen synthesis is accelerated by the action of the insulin by increasing the action of the enzyme or the expression of the enzyme called as the glycogen synthase. Now a very important thing is that uh, that uh, if we talk about the gluconeogenesis so it doesn't take place a very little in the muscle because the gluconeogenesis is already there in is uh, is only in the liver because the key enzymes which are responsible for causing the gluconeogenesis in the are present only in the liver not in the muscle so here we are not talking about the gluconeogenesis then another enzyme which is get increased or its expression get increased under the influence of insulin is the pyruvate dehydrogenase which is going to convert the pyruvate into the acetyl coenzyme now from here there will be synthesis of the air proteins as well as well as there will be synthesis of the lipid but lipid synthesis will not take place that much in the muscle because here we required glycogen we required protein okay muscle is basically about the protein and the energy source is the glycogen so lipid is not that much required in the muscle so there will be increase in the muscle synthesis and there will be decrease in the muscle uh, in the protein breakdown Okay, so protein synthesis will be increased and protein breakdown will be decreased. Okay, so these are the four major actions of the insulin on the muscle. So if you like this video, please like, share and comment. Let me know in the comment section what video you want me to do because I'm not receiving your comments. So please comment down so that I can make more and more videos. Let me know if any suggestion you have in uh, regarding our video quality or audio quality so that we can improve our as well as please follow us on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter and also subscribe to our channel if you haven't subscribed till yet. Check our slides on the slideshow and follow us there too. Till then, 